breaking news, my wonderful people. Most Nigerians have lost their basic fundamental human rights to the federal government. The APC government is always fond of going against those that have come out to speak the truth in one way or the other. And this has affected so many citizens in this country. In one way or the other, those that come out to speak the truth is either the federal government will persecute them unlawfully or will unlawfully beat them up and even kill them in the process. Look at where it has gotten Mazen Namdekanu and many others. Now, this issue is now coming into the Nigerian TV station authority. So many journalists in this country are now scared to tell the truth. And if any of them even comes out to speak the truth in one way or the other, you see the government wanting to sack that person. This is what we are seeing in our country. Which brings us to today's news report as Obi Ezekwesulu warns Tinibu, APC spokesperson, over alleged attempt to fire Rufai or Sani. Hello guys, welcome back to Prospect Channel TV. If you're joining us for the first time, kindly subscribe and please don't forget to give us a thumbs up. Thank you all for always coming out here. May God bless you all. Let's quickly hit the news to get full details. Obiageli Ezekwesulu, an economic policy expert and advocate for transparency, accountability, and good governance, human capital development, a humanitarian, and an activist, has called out the presidential candidate of the ruling All Progressive Congress, APC, and his campaign counsel for threatening to fire political journalist Rufai Osani on Arise TV. Earlier today, the co-host of Arise TV morning show opened up, alleging that some individuals were talking to his boss about having him off the TV show as he channeled his allegation in the direction of the ruling APC. Speaking about this, Obi Eze Kwesulu took to her official Twitter timeline as, he, as she urged the standard bearer of the APC, Ashwedu Bola Admetinibu, and his cohorts to desist from attempting to have Mr. Rufai fired. Her words, I advise Bola Admet Tinibu, the presidential candidate of the All Progressive Congress, and his campaign team to quit trying to intimidate Rufai or Sani of Arise TV for his objective analysis as a journalist. Stop it. You have the ones singing your praise, so leave Rufai for citizens. Be wise, my wonderful people. This is coming from Obiageli Ezekwesulu. She has taken to her Twitter handle to condemn the fact that APC spokesperson have alleged to wanting to fire Rufai or Sani over his objective analysis as a journalist. So now, speaking the truth and airing your own views in this country have now become a, a crime, Abby. The government is now attacking those who wants to air their views. I mean, speaking, uh, freedom of speech is, is a basic fundamental human right. So all man is allowed to speak freely and think freely, you know, without fear of being persecuted in one way or the other. This is what the APC government is trying to do now. And Tinibu is following in line, showing us his real character, that he will be a tyrant to the Nigerian economy if he eventually becomes the president of the Federal Republic of Nigeria. But God will not let that to happen. However, Nigerians have reacted to this. If they sack Rufai because of his objective position on political issues, they would have made a martyr out of him and the people will love him more and his voice will become louder. He doesn't need a job anymore 
is already a brand. I don't know why this woman thinks something and I believe there is nothing going to happen for it. Osani is a bad egg in a rice TV. He doesn't have any sense and I am disappointed in him. Okay? I pray that the young journalist won't be eliminated by some forces that are not happy with him. I advise he should be careful. Rufai lacks every medium of journalist ideas and professionalism. He should be fired. As for Obi, she, she's just been blinded by ethnicity. Hmm. Tinibu will continue from where Buhari government has stopped. As a tyrannical government, Nigerians beware. Nothing good will ever come out from uh, arrogant political criminals. Osani Rufai is gone already for always insulting Jagaban. Obi is a, is a politician side chick. She's looking onto obituary if she could be his concubine. What is your business with the firing of Rufai and warning being directed at Tinibu? Is Tinibu a member of, of Board of Arise TV? Hatred and misguided resentment building on your objective. Hmm. If Arise TV doesn't fire that Rufai or Sani of a man, he will definitely rock their boats. Nobody can fire Rufai or Sani. Everyone have his or her own option concerning this issue. This woman is descending too low these days because of your tribal and political affiliation. Have you subsisted the claim before you begin to send warning? As a senior citizen, you are meant to always be objective about your judgment. Anyway, maybe you are as guilty as the accused you are defending here. Thief Nibu is a tyrant. That is why God is going to disgrace him and his evil supporters. Because they did not mean well for the country. Tinibu poor supporters are doing it at because of tribalism. And his fellow politicians are supporting for their stomach, not for the betterment of the country. Let me say this again. Buhari will, will no doubt be better than Tinibu Shetima if voted into power. Tinibu will not care if he rules even for one year. His purpose is to make history and be placed among the past presidents of Nigeria. My wonderful people, these are reactions from, from Nigerians. This is what is happening. Kindly drop your...